Yeah. Yep. Hey, so you got a baby in there? Yeah. Oh, you just got a damn uh, uh, stroller. So look, what what does Jesus Christ look like? What would you say he would look like if he was walking today? Yeah, you believe in Jesus Christ, right? So what would he look like? Would he look like that? Jesus Christ looks like that. So you would say he's a white man. The, the son of God is a white man. <laughs> <laughs> you to laugh at that. The son of God is a white man. Damn. So look up. You you don't seen it. Is that your final answer? That's your final answer. The son of God is a white man. Who's looking at it now? And you're looking at other stuff. And as you're going, you're going away from what I'm trying to do. See? She's talking about right here. She's talking about right here. No, I'm not there. I just want to ask you a question. So that's your final answer that he will look the son of God. Is the son of God a white man? Yeah or nay? Yeah. Okay. We're going to show you at the Bible. Bring it out. Description of Jesus Christ. Right? Daniel, chapter 10, verse 6. Bring it out. Revelation, man, that's my go-to. That's the revelation of Jesus Christ. Revel revelation, 1 and 14. Read it out. His head and his hairs were white like wool. The last book of the Bible, the description of Jesus Christ, so he got wool hair. Does that guy have wool hair? Yay or nay? He, he does? Come on now, he got the same hair as you. You got wool hair? Man, what's, what's going on today? We can't believe everything. She said she got wool. Got to tell the Do you have woolly hair? She's or who had woolly hair today? It's woolly hair. It's, it's like, it's, it would be more like this, our hair. Oh, okay. You guys know that nappy hair. Who has nappy hair? So called nappy hair. What you guys call nappy? Today. 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 Uh, what kind of order? Like a flea disorder. A flea disorder? Yeah. Nappy yeah. hair, uh, woolly <laughs> hair comes from fleas? <laughs> <laughs> we have woolly hair. That's woolly hair. She said nappy hair comes from fleas. So this, 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 my brother's hair has got fleas in it? No, I don't know. I would call it nappy hair, though. That's fleas in there. Like, nappy hair to me would be like woolly hair. Like the, the, it's it's woolly. So who like, has the hair? woolly? That's my hair. Like, oh my god. They're trying to make it theirs. They flipping the whole wool. So check this out. Who got beady beads? What? Who got beady beads in their hair? Whose hair curls so hard that it, it, it looks it looks like this wool sheet texture. Whose hair does that? Real coarse, real, real coarse strong, hair. Wooly, curly, this guy. Matted hair. Who has them that that, that, that type of hair? What people? Hey. With the description of Christ, it, it, every time we talk to the so-called white people, it's hella hard to get through the verse. Right. You gotta be stumbling. Especially on that they wool. Stumble. That wool part scar. I'm just gonna give you the answer. Jesus Christ had woolly hair, and people that got woolly hair, woolly hair is more like is this sheep hair. Yeah. It's not your hair. Your hair is more like dog hair, yeah. Right? Massive hair. So you would have the fleas in your own hair. Right. You got the lice. Yeah, you got the, you got fleas, lice, and You got ticks. ticks. You got ticks in yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got ticks. See, not us. We got that wooly hair. See that? So look, now read, brother. Jump to 15. Verse 15. He and his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in a furnace. With your fat. With your fat. So he got fine, he, his feet were like unto fine brass. You with me? We put some ointment on. She got ticks. <laughs> she got ticks. So look, so look, look. So Jesus Christ is his feet with brass. You with me? What's your name? We're just gonna call you Beck. We don't care what your name is. We're gonna call you Beck. You listen, bro. Bro, what's up, bro? Bro, he already know this real. He know. I seen him from in the hood. Yeah, he be in the hood. 
What did he say? There might be pork? Yeah, from the hood. Becky, Becky. That's right. Well, you be Marvin. You be all over the place. You be all over the place. But look, Becky. See, she answered to the Becky. You can answer her name, Becky. Oh, that's your name, Becky? That's actually your name. OG, Becky. That's Rebecca the Becky. OG, Becky. <laughs> 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 For short. Sure. But she can come over here too. The, the, the actual Becky. The actual Becky. Don't try to run from the plantation. You're going to get this. You're going to get this work. Come back. Tell him about the gun line, boss. Tell him about the gun line. Tell him about the gun line, boss. She's trying to escape. Yeah. Come back. Come back. She went park the earth. 15. 15. Bring it out. And his feet. Like unto fine brass. He probably had feet. His feet was fine brass. What color is brass? Right. So his feet were brown. And what color do you get anything? What color does anything turn if you burn it? Like you, it turns what? Black. Well, right, watch this part. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burnt in a furnace. So. Jesus Christ's feet was so dark that they looked burnt, crispy. Right. right. So he was a black man with woolly hair. Right. Do you accept that? He would look more like Wesley Snipes right now. Right. Do you accept that? And do you accept that you was wrong that the Son of God is, does not look like that devil down there? Right. Do you accept that? Do you accept that? What? You don't know. We just read the description. Where can we find that description at the Bible? We just read it. OG Becky. Right here. Daniel 10 and 6. Bring it out. His body also was like the burrow, and his face as the appearance of lightning. Becky, pay attention. Pay attention. So, so look, check this out. Before you leave, we're going, you gotta say Jesus Christ is a black man. Say it. Jesus Christ is a black man. The woolly hair. Woolly hair. And he would look like Wesley Snipes if he was here. And he would look like Wesley Snipes if he was here. Right. Wesley Snipes with an afro. There you go. There you go. Right. So she admitted. We, we ain't gonna let her leave, so she admitted. Right. Right. So now right. say it. Now say it. Give me, um, give me a. Uh, Every idle word. What's that? Five, Matthew 536, I believe. But you see how Esau is a goddamn devil. <laughs> the Bible speaks of. You know, she, we read it. She said, nope, I still believe in that. Matthew 12 and 36. Goddamn, 12 and 36. Esau, so called white man, woman, the child is a goddamn devil that the Bible speaks of. That's right. Right? Yeah, hey, I got a question for you. She said shalom or hello? She already said. She said shalom? I think so. I don't know. Bro, you gotta repent, bro. Yeah, you already know. You gotta quit walking to and fro. Yeah. To and fro. You're impaired. You're impaired. I know that much. But I ain't even gonna get you started because last time you already know what happened. I know. I know. Right. Right. I ain't gonna get you started. Right. 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 Yeah, I ain't gonna get, I ain't gonna get bro started. He'll actually, he'll actually put him up with you. <laughs> but we good, we good, we bro. What about his bald head? You gotta grow your, your head. You gotta grow your beard out, bro. Give me um, Ezekiel thirty three and thirty. <laughs> Try to get on the other side of the fence. Watch this. Can you be hearing the word? But. I'm gonna give you this one verse. I'm gonna give you this one verse. This is the book Ezekiel, chapter 33, and verse 30. Bring it out. And it reads Also, thou son of man, the children of thy people still are talking against thee by thy walls and in the doors of the houses. 
Verse 31, and they come unto thee as the people cometh, and they sit before thee as my people, and they hear thy words. You come in, you hear the word, but they will not do them. But, but he, shall, he, he ain't doing what? But they, they will not, not do, do them. them. Don't backslide. So Don't backslide. you hear the word, but you're not doing the read. But they will not do them, for with their mouth, they show much love, but their heart. When his mouth he show much love, he'll tell us how a good job he's doing. You know, he'll he'll actually say, "I love God." Mm. You know, etc. God. They show much love, but their heart goes after their covetousness. Covetousness. But his mind gonna go after what he want to do. Maybe a brew. He gonna he gonna he gonna do what he want to do. Read, bro. God. Covetousness. Verse 32, and lo, thou art unto them as a very lovely song. See, he's listening like it's a, like we're a lovely tune that he writes. Right. Like, it's a lovely tune. So you're out here listening. We I ain't seen you plenty of times. And you listen to the word like it's damn uh, Chris Brown or something, right? Read that again. And lo, thou art unto them as a very lovely song of one that has a pleasant voice and can play well on an instrument. Right? For they hear thy words, but they do them not. He hear the word, but he ain't going to do it. Read. Verse 33. And when this cometh to pass, lo. When everything comes to pass, we're talking about destruction. That's why we're telling you to get right. When it comes to pass, what? And when this cometh to pass, lo, it will come. Then shall they know that a prophet has been among them. Mm. Before he gets destroyed, he's going to be like, he's going to be like, damn. He's going he, 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 he to be like, damn. The brother was telling the truth. Now, 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 now I got to die. Now I'm about to get destroyed. So that's what's going to happen to the brother man over here. And with that, I say, Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.